and, and what's good for us as journalists is he's not afraid to mince his words. He did say that the appointment of Esther yeah. McVeigh, we're in the Wirral now, um, would strike fear into the hearts of, of the vulnerable. What was your immediate reaction when she was put in, in charge of the DWP? Same, same as Dan, I was very disappointed. I had, I had disability groups contact me who could not believe that Theresa May had done this based upon some of the statements that Esther McVeigh had done that said about disabled people and the policies that she implemented last time around. So I think people were pretty shocked. You, you, you've been described as, as pure evil by Andrea Leadsom, which I think yeah. was over the comments last time. Is that, is that something you regret saying, or is no. it, it was obviously repeating someone else's comment? No. Well, I attended the meeting in the constituency, and I reported what was shouted out at that time, basically. Mm. Actually, I made a statement in Parliament saying afterwards, I don't agree with these things, but you need to understand that's the strength of feeling among some people. I don't, I don't, I don't think the Conservatives fully understand the human suffering that they implemented and they are implementing for disabled people and the strength of feeling that there is in the community about that. Dan reflected that and I think I was real disappointed that Theresa May appointed to that role.